What's up, T gang? You know, say your girl just chin, and today she's back live in living colors with another vlog. You don't know it's been a year since I've done a vlog, and I'm super excited. It's already Monday morning, so you don't know we have Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and you don't know, so I'm gonna get the video on Sunday. Um, you know, I started this 75 days challenge, guys. We're I, I see it on TikTok, and I can't, you know, I've always tried to diet, but every time I do it and I lose the weight, I stop and then I started eating back. I started to eat back the junk food rather, and then you know, I've just put on the weight again. But this time around, I'm doing 75 days that's two months and some change, I guess. And I've been doing good, it's my I think fourth day. I've been eating well. Um, um, it's just it's it's hard, and sometimes my body feels like I need something different and I'm craving something different. But at the end of the day, I have to just remember the reason why I started. I want to be healthy. I want to start fitting in my clothes again because my clothes doesn't fit like they used to. And for me, that's nothing good, you know. My belly is getting out of control. I know I always have the thick, thick around the back there. You know what I mean? <laughs> But at the end of the day, guys, health comes first. And I just want to be healthy. I want to feel good in my body again. I want to feel like me again. I don't feel like myself anymore. My clothes, my pants, my blows, nothing fits. And I have to be going a size up. And when I do that, it's like I'm telling myself that I'm comfortable with the weight that I'm actually at, which I'm not. So, you know, that has to change. Right, it's a she. Right, it's a girl. So, it's my little cousin's birthday, guys. I'll insert a picture on the screen. Yeah, yeah, birthday queen. <laughs> um, and we're in Puma right now, guys. Um, me not show you, Lorian. Me don't know you're free the camera. You're pretty. Anyways, um, so guys, um, I'm in front of this store, right? In Portmore. it's called the Famished. That's the name, and it's a healthy food, and they cater for vegan and vegetarian. And like you heard, I told you a while ago. Or should I say a few minutes ago um, while I was leaving work that I wanted to start eating healthy and I'm thinking about um, changing my diet which I have based on what I told you so it's so funny that I came over here and the first thing that I saw was this place they do natural juice as well with protein shakes and all but that's vegan protein shakes so you have to know the difference between um, they say like steamed fish um, I don't remember what they call their rice, but you know they have a special rice. This is the place, it's in Portmore, right there. Alright, so if you're interested, you can come on over. So yeah, so I'm super excited about this journey. I am I, I'm just excited to see where this is going to take me. I mean I've done this so many times. I've seen myself lose five pounds, nine pounds, and as soon as I lose the weight, I go right back and I start eating the junk food. So I want to see how long I can keep this so that it can actually show in my physical appearance that I'm actually losing it. I remember one time when I was losing the weight, guys, my friend said to me, um, you lose weight? I'm like, oh my gosh, it makes me feel so good because actually, it's actually showing in my body. So I'm so happy for that, um, you know. So yeah, and I've ordered, so first of all, we were supposed to go to Boda, but I guess what's on the menu, not everybody wants what's on the menu. I didn't order it to be pricey. But I chose a, I think it's called a chicken salad. Yes, I chose a salad, um, chicken salad. And uh, I don't remember what juice I chose, but it's actually um, fresh juice. They make it from scratch, from fruits and all of that. So I'm sticking to it. I'm not gonna let anything kind of get in my way. If I'm going to eat out, I'm definitely not gonna consume anything that's going to, you know, um, bring me back to where I'm coming from. One bite out of it comes like it, it, it's like you're going right back to square one. I don't want that. So, um, some people get uh, pasta. Oh my god, it's so near. Oh, okay, guys, but I get the boring food. <laughs> um, yes, nothing fried. So, yeah, so that's what, what I'm eating, guys. So, I'll be back after we stop the face later.
But she don't love me, she's too scary My hope is fun like Jackie Brown Ooh, funny. <laughs> I wanna know what she too down Will you be my leading lady? I want a contract, girl, no maybe In the meantime It's the meantime I'll be doing what you want Crib on the beach like Odell so guys, I'm back in Sovereign. I don't know, so maybe I'll give the, the vegan food a try. Or should I say, probably I'll try with the milkshake at first. Probably I'm not go straight into the, this vegan um, food. Probably I'm give the milkshake a try. It's a vegan milkshake, that is. So, let's go. All right, guys, so me, me just come from the vegan store a while ago. I couldn't record. Well, I could, but I just never in a mood for record. Um. I know I didn't give it this a big old try if you suck up so much ice in. But um I'm gonna do a taste test. This is called the vegan protein shake. And this is what it looks like. You see there. A lot of nuts. So it's a thousand dollars for this cup. Oh Jesus. Alright, let's try. Look at that, guys. I would like my mother to taste something like this. It tastes exact. Don't watch on my face, soup, guys. I can't eat thick. I'm like drink thick stuff. That's why I'm trying to make it creamy. But my mom, my dad used to make juice like this. Blend up, blend up, and all these things. It's just that probably it was not protein shit because it never had the protein powder, which is the vegan protein powder. But trust me, it tastes good. It could have been a little bit cooler. She likes she could have put more ice in it so that it's cooler. You know, when it's cooler, it tastes a little bit better. So she could have probably next time when I go there, I'm going to tell them more ice. On a scale of one to ten, if I was supposed to rate it, I will definitely give it an eight out of ten. Today is Friday, it's the end of the week. Thank you, Jesus. Thank God it's Friday. I'm super excited for this beautiful day that God has made. Um, I am heading to work right now. As I know, it's Friday, so it's just down day. So I'm having a nice little t shirt and a nice little jeans and a slippers. Well, it's a Puma slippers, so it's not one of those flip flops. And yeah, my hair, it's been three and a half weeks now since I did my hair. I probably can insert a picture what it looks like when I just did it. And you know, you looking at it now, a really ruggy, or not ruggy, it's not nappy. Yeah, that's the word. Yeah, was looking for that word. But I have some um, jam here. Um, what I'm gonna do is kind of fix up the edges them so it don't look too bad and as they know I'm a gun but natural guys so the ear is if you pull up everything that we pull up and if you're seeing this burn right here guys it's the hot comb that do this but anyways so yeah today is Friday and tomorrow is Saturday and I'm super excited for the new week to come um I have a hair to do tomorrow so if anything we can I'm gonna see bits and pieces of it it won't be long um i think she wants her hair neck length some would have just shown what it look like and all of that guys from 
Christ. Don't judge me. Promise is trying to learn how to do no. her hair. No. Guys. No. I'm going to put this side. Guys, what? Promise is learning. 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 They know what is. Learning. This no reach perfection yet. <laughs> it's a learning stage. <laughs> Anyways, so that's it. <laughs> Show your face, man. Show them all your cute, no brat. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that's it. I'm heading out now. So see you in the next clip. So I know the video is moving a little bit fast, guys, but that's because I wanted to just get this hairstyle done. I didn't want the vlog to be too long. So here goes. I'm doing my friend's hair. Um, she asked for a bob, but I wanted to give her a little bit more length. Of course, in real life, you're going to have to pay more money for the length. However, for me, I don't really work like that. I mean, she just need like an inch or two more, so I'm just going to do that. Her hair was very short at the front and at the back, as she said, stated before we did the hair. She said that she had some issues and she's going to get a cut after this hairstyle is out. So, yeah, so that's it. I hope you like it. I hope you enjoyed this little part of it. And we're out. Baby, I don't know why you're treating me so bad. You said you love me, don't want to me. And I was all you had. Baby, I can't stop crying. just a few person who provide silk press in Jamaica and you know I just wanted to get my hair silk press because you know I grew up my hair from the relaxed ends and I cut them and I'm, I'm not natural but I really think that it's uneven it's very uneven so my whole aim is to get it properly clipped
So your girl got her hair silk pressed, guys. Um, it's such a beautiful feeling to be in a chair that, you know, the person really enjoys doing what she's doing. She's, you know, teaching you ways how to take care of your hair. You know, we don't really have lots of that these days. Some people just think about themselves and that's it. They only think about the money and they don't really tell you what to do and what not to do. Well, it's my first time in this shop and as you can see, I'm talking, I'm interacting with the other persons in the shop and that's because I felt very comfortable. I didn't feel out of place. I didn't feel like I wasn't, I didn't belong there. I felt like I knew these people all along and that's the level of customer service that they have and I must say appreciate that to the core. Um, this lady that's currently doing my hair, I don't know her. Today's my first time meeting her and while talking to her over the phone, trust me, I enjoyed talking to her. Um, yeah, so the experience was very good. Um, I did this silk purse not to just wear it, but, uh, you know, like I said earlier, I really wanted to, like, cut my hair on the same level or clip my hair on the same level, but it was more, more like a clip, not a cut. Um, cause I did a big chop the other day. I was in the bathroom and I was washing my hair and I was like, oh my God, I have so much new growth. And I just started holding the hair and start to clip the ends. And just like that, I was naturally in a couple of seconds or a couple of minutes. So, um, because I knew that I was the one who did it and it was not even, I decided to go and get it professionally done to get it clipped. So, um, I told her my hair is, I sweat a lot in my scalp. So I know that my silk press won't last and that's okay. I really don't feel any way about that because even since I came home, there has been a little different, like a slight difference within the hair. But I told her already, that I don't feel any way about that because I know the type of hair that I have. And even when I had relaxed hair, man, the cream would sweat out of my hair so quickly and I would have so many new growth. So I know the kind of hair that I have, but Trust me, I didn't allow that to bother me. I was just excited to get the, the bad ends off. And, you know, I just can't go on with my life with my natural hair. And I just want to leave this um here at the end of the video. Ladies, love your hair. Love your hair. You don't have to cream your hair. We grew up in a world where we think that um, bone straight hair is beautiful. Your beautiful coils and your curls, different patterns of curls. We have 4C hair, 4B hair, 4BC, all type of alphabetical, all type of hair. And it's beautiful. So embrace your hair and get products that will pop your hair quality. And, you know, just the same as you would treat your relaxed hair. Do the same for your natural hair. I'm super excited about being on my natural hair journey. And I'm just hoping that I can keep it up. And, you know, do the right things, put the right treatments in the hair and all of that. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. It's not yet finished, but I just wanted to put that out there. Listen to me, customer service, out of 10, 10. No joke, guys. I already, um, I got insert pictures and our name. We don't need to link our persons in a St. Catherine and Pope Maurice and all if you're there, Kingston and you're driving, you want to come or you have a look at anti-time taxi or whatever the case may be. We don't need to come check out the lady, the lady here. The lady here, and she have the good product them. And I know regular shampoo, she have the whole line of product them where she using at the ear. By the way, this is the end of the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Tell somebody about the Justin channel and stay tuned for another video to come. Baby, don't you know,